teacher seems to have sparked something in Ferguson. Well, it's that artistic bent that runs in the family. Oh, shouldn't you guys be going? The dance starts in an hour. Yeah, but I don't know how much dancing there'll be tonight. The instructor we hired to teach everyone the Latin hustle blew us off to work a Gloria Gaynor convention. Well, you know, Sport, your, your mom and I used to be quite the Latin hustlers back when, you know. We'd be more than happy to drop by the school. And, huh? What do you say? <laughs> I don't think so, Marshall. As far as I'm concerned, school's out. This is an emergency alert. What's the emergency? Find out as 90210 calls 911 from the roundhouse. Next on SNCC. 17. Seventeen. Wait, did I count that cell or not? It's no fair when they keep moving around. It's hard to believe so many living cells are in every drop of water. And what about in a whole glass? How many is that? Millions? Hundreds of millions? Kind of grosses you out, unless you're thirsty. See ya, fellas. Some people have trouble contemplating higher numbers. Millions, billions, trillions. But for me, it's easy. For example, 1,256,011 times, I've asked my parents, can I have a car? 1,256,011 times, they've answered, no way, Jose. Let's take a trip down memory lane. Unfortunately, I won't be in the driver's seat. I tried leaving little subtle clues around so Dad would know what I wanted for my birthday. I guess early morning isn't the best time to be subtle with Dad. I tried buttering them up with a special home-cooked meal. Ooh, thanks, sweetheart. But it was no use. Mom cut right through all my arguments. I even tried showing them how having a car would fit easily into our lives. But Dad rolled all over that one. So about this car thing, let's just say owning an auto is a subject I've driven into the ground. But as far as I can recall, there isn't a single instance where they told me I couldn't have one of these. kinds of reasons why owning a motorcycle beats owning a car. First, there's speed. Cars require unlocking the door, getting in, buckling your seatbelt, adjusting the mirror. Too slow. I figure I can get on the back of the cycle from the back door in 2.5 seconds. Next, there's maneuverability. Why, well, you can maneuver a whole fleet of cycles in the space of one car. And best of all, they can't ask you to drop your little brother off somewhere. There's no trunk. <laughs> So, what's all this about owning a motorcycle? Well, the idea came up kind of casually. Olivia kind of casually mentioned her older brother Marlon was selling his 75 to get a larger bike. I don't know what his problem is with these motorcycles anyway. Who does he think he is, macho man Marlon? Just as casually, I planted the idea that maybe I could buy it. Do you think he'll take 50 bucks? Okay. I know it's not a car, but it is a motor vehicle. And for the first time, it's actually within my grasp. I hope he says yes. That cycle needs a kind, loving home. But knowing Marlon, I'm afraid money talks. Hi, Sam. Hey, Clarissa. Guess what I found in my basement just waiting for an opportunity like this to arrive. 